come for my boys, and you will know the taste of a savage's blade. If you ever notice the length, the man will go to protect his family. So the story of Davy Crockett, I think all of us probably know the song that we grew up with, Killed in Mabar when he was only three. That was basically what I knew about Davy Crockett. So where did you fall in love with this story and, and what did you know about it? How did you find it? Uh, well, you know, I'm... 51 and so I was sort of at the tail end of you know the Disney era and right. Fest Parker and that legend was a big part of our my childhood and growing up even though I grew up in New England um, I have no claim to you know Davy Crockett as part of our regional heritage but he was a uh, you know and I didn't understand obviously as a kid we just thought about you know being a good fighter and a good marksman and you know all the things the myths that we tried to weave into here like the origin of the coonskin cap i don't know if i picked up on that or uh you know the legend that he could at 20 paces throw a double-sided axe into a tree and split a musket ball so we tried to put those common passed down mythologies into a historical fiction storyline just like what would what's my vision of how that came to be i guess is the point um so that's sort of an that this film is, I guess, in a way, an insight into my relationship to Davy as a kid.